Okay, here we go. This game is called Go to Bed. Situation one, subject A. Go to bed. I can't move. Oh, there we go. Can we leave? Should I go to bed now? Hold on, hold on, hold on. What if I like go to bed and the game's over? Let me let me get a little bit out of this. Let me get all my money's worth. Close the window. Is it already closed? Okay, now it's closed. Dude, good thing I saw that. Uh, press E to arm home security system. Can we watch TV? Press E to make a sandwich. Can we leave? E to lock door. Oh, dude. Not only do we lock the door, we put a padlock on the handle. All right, so let's arm the security system. Here we go. Press E to use what? Oh, oh, the door. Like, I was standing here. I thought maybe there's something like around me other than the door. Okay, uh, turn off the lights. No, nope, can't turn off the lights. I guess there's nothing left to do other than go to bed. Did, did you lock the front door? I did. Dude, good thing I fucking locked the door. Did you close the window? I, I did that too. Did you arm the security system? Yes. Are the cops going to show up? Did you hide the knives? What the fuck, dude? I didn't see any knives. I tried to open the, the refrigerator, but I didn't see anything else over there while I was like dicking around. No. He cut the he cut the security system with the knife, I guess. Oh, we're fucking dead. Here, here we go. Situation failed as someone got in. What if I lied? Did you hide the knives? Yes. Did you hide the knives? What do you mean hide the knives? Dude, has, has anybody ever gone to bed, but before you went to bed, you went out in the kitchen and like hid your knives? If, if a burglar breaks in and wants your knives, he's just gonna fucking find them. I mean, there's only so many drawers in your kitchen. I hide my knives under my pillow. Worst sleep I've ever had, but God damn it, it feels good to be safe. All right, round two. All right, window shut. Security system armed. Door locked. Knives hidden. I put them in my pocket. I hope I don't roll over on them in my sleep. Now, is there anything else? I guess I need to like look everywhere. Did you hide the photo? You don't want the burglar getting a good look at you. Did you fold the laundry? Dude, I don't see anything else. No, that, that has to be the only thing we missed. Did you turn off the stove in case the burglar wants to burn your place down? Okay. There's, there is nothing else to interact with. I'm going to do one more pass just to be safe. All right. That has to be it. And this is situation one. So uh, definitely want to shut that just in case. So I'm assuming there's going to be more situations. Can't believe I missed the knives. Did you lock the front door? Yes. Did you close the window? Yes. Okay. I kind of want to say no, 
Because I did. I want to see what the game does. Because if I say no, and then the burglar gets in and the, the alarm's not a factor, that means that the game doesn't even know what we did until we answer the questions. I'm going to say no just for research purposes. Okay. So even though I said no, the game does detect it. Did you hide the knives? Yes. I'm sleeping with them. There's the cops. All right, I don't think we missed anything. Well done. No one will get in. It sounded like they kind of did, though. I mean, they broke the window, right? Next situation. Situation two, subject B. What if we just go right to bed here? Fuck it. YOLO. Is the house secure? Oh, uh, yes. Good enough for me. I live in a really good neighborhood. I trust my neighbors. Okay. They won't let you even go to bed unless you actually do shit. All right, we have garbage, bottles. Same laundry baskets following us. All right, so here we go. Lock the door. Arm the security system. Close the window. What's that? Is that like a basement? Like a trap door? Can we put the couch over the trap door? Hide the knives. Dude, what if they force us to fail? Like the knives, I didn't see any prompt for the knives the first time. Maybe they, maybe they withhold shit to make you freak out. Like I thought I got everything. Cause as of right now, I'll be a little disappointed if that's the whole game. You know, like if every uh, situation C, lock the door, set the alarm, shut the window, hide the knives. There's got to be something else, but I'm not seeing anything. And I don't trust this trap door. Did you take out the garbage? We definitely didn't do that. Did you find and read death cord three? All right, let's not drag this out. We're going to bed. Yes. The house is secure. Are you sure? Yes. Good. Next situation. So that's it? Like every situation is... Huh? Where am I? How did I get here? Okay. Okay. No lights. Can't see shit. No flashlight. This is where we die. Whoa! I need to leave now. All right, so we got deer carcasses in the closet. Is that what that is? Pig. I think it's a pig. All right, that's locked. Maybe a pig. I don't know. I need to get out of here. Does it look like a robot face? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is it looking at me? Oh, we found a body. Hey, you good? Oh, we got a key. We're probably gonna have to run from somebody. Is the body gone? <gasps> the body, dude, the body is gone. It's like Saul. We have a Saul situation. 
where the killer was playing dead the whole time. Okay. I think the door was in here, right? No, no, no. That's the bedroom. Oh my god, dude. Here we go. Here's the door. We're dead. There's no way we're getting out of this. I need to find a way out. Isn't this our apartment? We can't disarm that. Can't go in there. I guess break the glass. Okay, it's shut. I should check for an alarm before I before I try. I did. Oh, here we go. Press E to check home security system. Okay, it's armed. Maybe I can cut the wire. All right. So E to check knives. Uh, they put away anything useful. So how do we cut the wires? Okay, no use, it's locked, and needs a code. There's no way out, maybe back downstairs. Oh my god. So, we were playing as the killer? Right? Because th this is the house we were previously in, and then we went to bed. We made sure everything was, was good to go. But it turns out that we were captive in the basement. Why aren't you in bed? Oh! Oh, is that it? I guess that's it. Oh! I don't know if it's that deep though. I I'm going back in. I'm going back in, I like that idea. Subject B, maybe we don't hide the knives. Then when we wake up as the, as the captive, the knives are there. We use the knives to cut the alarm system and then we can actually get out. If that's even an option, I, don't, I feel like the game isn't that deep. That idea is way too good for this game. The dev's like, you know, I never even thought of that. All right, so this one's a little speed run. Okay, here we go. Situation two, we're, I'm, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna do everything else, but I'm going to uh, leave the knives out and see if that makes a difference. So when we wake up as the other dude, Although we might fail because it's going to ask us, did you do this? Did you do that? And if I say no to the knives, then we might, we might die anyway. So I'm going to do this, this, and that. Not take the knives. Go in the bed. Okay, is the house secure? Oh, yeah. So this one doesn't even go through all the, all the things. It just asks you one question. Yes. Are you sure? Yeah. Except for the knives. Good. Next situation. All right. I think we're on to something. Huh? Where am I? How did I get here? Oh, th there's another. Oh, I didn't even think about this. We can go to bed. All right. We'll try that one too. I never thought about going back to bed down here. God, that's so creepy. Like, it's creepy knowing that he's alive. And he's not wearing pants. This has to be what we're supposed to do. So, I'm gonna go over here. Oh, we gotta go to the window first. Okay, checking window. And then to the alarm. Okay, cut the wires. And I'm going to grab the knives that we left out and use that to cut the wires. It's kind of cool that we're playing both sides of the story here. Okay. Now I can escape out the window. Oh, that's it. So we escaped out the window. Cool. I said it wasn't that deep or it probably wasn't going to be that deep. It was pretty deep. Okay. Let's, let's, let's do this again. We're going to go back to bed in the uh in the murderer's dungeon and see what happens all right so it doesn't matter what we do in fact i'm just gonna let everything the 
the way it is. All right, so is the house secure? Sure. We are the killer. Yes, I'm sure. Good. <laughs> I didn't do anything. I didn't take the knives. I didn't lock the door. I didn't shut the window. Because I just want to do this. How did I get here? All right, we're just going to go to bed and see what happens. No, I need to get out of here. Oh, we can't. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just go out the front door. Okay, grab the key. Step over the killer. That is cool, though. I like that little move. It's subtle. But the fact that the, the body moves from the floor when you pick up the key. Okay. I'm walking right out the front door. Need to find a way out. Well, catch you on the flippity flip. It's unlocked. I can escape. Woo, woo. Oh, I didn't set the alarm. That's right. Never mind. I was going to say, but the alarm still goes off. But we didn't even do that. I didn't do anything. So there's like no difference in the endings other than just the fact that you know you got the endings. They don't acknowledge like, oh, that was ending two out of three or ending three out of three. But it's still cool that they let you do other options. I like I like that. I like that it was a short game, but there was a little bit more to it if you just peeled back the layers a little bit. I like that.